Welcome. Today we explore the dynamic littoral zone, the fascinating area where the land meets the sea, constantly changing with tides. This intertidal region is exposed to air during low tide and submerged underwater during high tide, creating unique environmental conditions. It's a zone of extremes facing pounding waves, fluctuating temperatures, salinity changes, and periods of intense sunlight or complete darkness. Littoral zones vary greatly. Let's first look at rocky shores, characterized by hard substrates like boulders and bedrock. These shores provide stable surfaces for organisms to attach, but they face the full force of wave action. Next are sandy shores composed of loose sediment. This environment is constantly shifting due to waves and currents. Life here often involves burrowing into the sand for protection from predators and the drying effects of low tide. Finally, muddy shores or mudflats are found in sheltered areas like estuaries. They consist of fine silt and clay. The soft sediment is rich in organic matter but low in oxygen, presenting unique challenges for resident organisms. Life in the littoral zone is incredibly diverse and specially adapted. Organisms must cope with constant environmental shifts. On rocky shores, creatures like barnacles and mussels cement themselves firmly to withstand powerful waves and avoid drying out. Sea anemones retract their tentacles at low tide, while limpets clamp down tightly, trapping moisture. In sandy shores, clams, worms, and crabs burrow deep into the sediment for safety and moisture retention. Ghost crabs scuttle across the sand, often camouflaged, scavenging for food washed ashore by the tides. Mudflats support specialized burrowers like lugworms and mud shrimps, adapted to low oxygen, soft sediment conditions. Shorebirds are common predators here, probing the mud with long beaks to find hidden invertebrates during low tide. Littoral zones are ecologically vital. They act as nurseries for many fish species and buffer coastlines from storm surges. They filter pollutants from runoff and are crucial feeding grounds for migratory birds and other wildlife. However, these zones face significant threats from human activities like coastal development, pollution, and habitat destruction. Pollution, such as oil spills and plastic debris, severely impacts the delicate life residing in the intertidal area. Climate change also poses risks through sea level rise, increased storm intensity, and ocean acidification, altering these habitats. Protecting littoral zones involves managing coastal development, reducing pollution, and addressing climate change impacts. The littoral zone, a place of constant change and remarkable adaptation, is essential for coastal ecosystems and biodiversity. Understanding and conserving these dynamic environments is crucial for the health of our oceans and planet. From microscopic plankton to large shorebirds, the littoral zone supports a complex web of life worth protecting. Let's appreciate the resilience of life in this challenging interface between land and sea.